Hi parents, hi boys and girls, your coach here, Noel, to help you again with your first grade math, okay? And what we're going to be talking to you about today are these three concepts, greater than, less than, or equal to, okay? And this symbol pointing to the right means greater than. This symbol pointing to the left means less than. And this symbol means equal to, okay? So, I've got these sets of numbers that we're going to be comparing, okay? And this is how I want you to do it. Here I've got the number 55. Here I have the number 65. The first number we're going to compare is the tenths place. Now, which one is larger, the 5 or the 6? The 6, right? So 55 is smaller than 6, so which one are we going to use? Greater than, less than, or equal to? Less than is correct, because 5 is less than 6. And there you go. Now let's take a look at these next two numbers. We have 43 and 29. What numbers are we going to compare first? The tens place. We're going to compare the 4 and the 2. Is the 4 bigger than or smaller than the 2? It's bigger than the 2, right? So what am I going to use? Greater than, less than, or equal to? That is absolutely correct. I'm going to use greater than. So I'm going to use the greater than symbol and put it right there. Now let's take a look at the next problem. Here we have 31 and 35. What is the first numbers that I'm going to take a look at? The tens place, right? Look at the 3. Look at the 3. Are they the same? They are. So we have to now move on to the ones place. So now we have a 1 and we have a 5. Is the 1 smaller than the 5, or is it bigger than the 5? It's smaller, right? So that means that it's less than. So I'm going to use this symbol here, and I'm going to draw it right there. 31 is less than 35. Now let's take a look at this number here, 46 and 46. We start with the tens place, 4 and 4. Those are the same, right? Yep. So what do I do? Go on to the next digit, the ones place. Here I have a 6 and a 6. Are they the same? They are, right? Okay, so in this case, what would I use? Greater than, less than, or equal to? That's absolutely correct. I'm going to use equals. Equal to, okay? Let's look at the next set of numbers. Here I've got 71 and 91. What digit do I look at first? The tens place, right? Look at the 7, look at the 9. Is 7 bigger or smaller than 9? Is it greater than or less than 9? 7 is less than 9, right? So which, which symbol am I going to use? Less than this one, right? Yes, okay. Put that one right there. And we have one last example. Here I've got 24 and 21. Let's look at the tens place first. We have a 2 and a 2. Same number, so what do I do? I go on to the ones place. Look at the ones place. Now I've got a 4 and a 1. Is 4 greater than 1 or is it less than 1? 4 is bigger, right? Great. So I'm going to use greater than. I'm going to use this symbol. And there you go. So now let's go ahead and let's see how we would read these. Okay, boys and girls? 55 is less than 65. 43 is greater than 29. 31 is less than 35, 46 is equal to 46, 71 is less than 91, and 24 is greater than 21. And that's pretty much it, boys and girls. Not bad, right? Keep up the outstanding work. Keep practicing. You've got tons of practice problems to do, but I know you're enjoying it because you're an outstanding student and you always try your absolute best. Parents, thank you so much, and we'll see you at the next video.